I got it all. It is 5.15 a.m. I'm on my way to work right now. It's a Monday. One, two, three, four, five, six, six or seven personal training sessions today, something like that. A group training class in there as well. Pretty typical day today. My morning shift is over. That little like time lapse sequence kind of stuff was actually from last Friday. I had time to film some time lapses. I remember watching Casey Neistat video. He talked about him doing time lapses. He would actually go and like spend a night filming like a bunch of different time lapses and using them for different videos. So I did that today. Kind of nice. Save some time once in a while. Hi, sorry, I was just getting I was just getting my car ready to call me back. It's crazy nice outside today. Like 40, maybe 50 degrees. Ugh. I went hiking over the weekend because it was super super nice. My boots got really muddy and then I left them outside. I gotta clean these guys off, they're really bad. All of the hoses are still completely frozen, so I gotta figure out something else to clean my hands off. Okay, this will do the trick for now. It's completely frozen. It's not perfect, but if I'm being honest, I just need to like wipe all the mud and ice off of them. And I'm gonna let them sit out to dry. I have new hiking boots or trail runners coming in the mail pretty soon anyway. far too nice of a day to be stuck inside. That's what's so crazy about Wisconsin weather is that three days ago it was like eight degrees. Today it's 40 degrees. Doesn't make any sense. That's really overexposed. Like I said, it's way too nice outside to be sitting indoors. So I'm just gonna walk around outside before I have to go back to work. I was also working Saturdays for a long time. I'm done with that. Can't do it. Working six days a week is too much. I'm the kind of person who likes to do this, to be outside, outdoors, and not be in the gym all the time. I do love the gym, but I can't stay indoors in the gym six days a week. Can't do it. Remember my last video where everything, where everything was completely frozen? Look at this now. This is all just water along this entire trail. <laughs> now everything's just mud and wet and slushy. Guys found on this tree. <laughs> it's like a little a bear? I think it's a bear that someone just stuffed into the tree. Oh that poor thing. I think I'm gonna leave it there. I don't want to mess with that. 
Don't want any bad juju. <laughs> I want to get over to that thing, but I gotta walk across this. I don't know how solid this is gonna be. I'm gonna try it. Let's see what happens. Pretty slushy, but solid so far. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> nope, nope. I got wet. <laughs> Oh, <sighs> yeah, not the brightest decision. How much time do I have? I gotta work in 45 minutes. I gotta go back home and get <laughs> new shocks. I gotta go home and get new socks and shoes. <laughs> As I'm walking back to my car, what I was gonna talk about, it's already Monday and I've had five cancellations for personal training sessions this week. A lot of people are getting sick right now, not like COVID stuff, but there's like some weird cold thing kind of going around through the gym. <sighs> Another thing, it's kind of starting to get towards the end of winter now. It's the last day in February as I'm filming this video. And I am so, so ready to go on a road trip. It's been since October when I went on my last Gila National Forest. So it's been a long time and I'm really, really itching to travel. It's the busy season for personal training. So during the winter, you don't really take too many vacations just because you kind of pack as many sessions in as you can. But the good news is that towards the end of March, I am leaving to go on a trip to Utah and California. The plan is to go to Zion National Park in Utah. Super cool looking park, I've never been there. And then also visit Death Valley in California. So I'm very, very much so looking forward to those trips that are coming up. Okay, I gotta get back home and change my shoes. <laughs> I think my roommate left some pizza out. <laughs> this is very hard to do, holding the camera and two pieces of pizza. Oh my god! Oh! Oh, okay, back to work. I will see you guys at like 6 p.m. Look at how bright it is outside right now. Like it's so beautifully bright. This gets me excited because that means summer is getting close and that means outdoor activities and camping and hiking and outdoors, everything. I cannot wait. I made it to my session on time. I was still like 10 minutes early, which is good. My pants were a little bit wet, but not too bad. But I made it and it was all good. I gotta get some groceries really quick and then I'm headed home. That's gonna be the end of the video. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you in my next one. Peace out. <laughs>